How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Of course. Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. I'll find your hat, okay. Clementine. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Duck. Such an idiot. Want something to eat? Uh. Have an apple, Carly. God, I used to eat an apple every morning with some granola and six almonds, and that wasn't enough even then. But you know what? Yes. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Okay, a Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> <laughs> How can yeah. you mind? I'll stop and get a Sunday for you. Have any more food? Duck is hungry too. Yeah, why don't we then get some food? Uh, sorry, Duck. You're not getting food. Want something to eat? Have some jerky. Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Uh, no. Come talk to me once my boy's taken care of. Well, if you don't want your piece, then I'll give it to him. Hey, Doc. How about a little food? Here. Yeah! Oh, man, I'm so hungry! I only got one piece left. I'm gonna be a good leader. Uh, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. I don't know who to give it to. Maybe I should give it to the guy that's helping the old dude just to say fuck you right in his own face. <sighs> Lily thinks we should throw these new people out. Damn right! There's too many people hanging around here as it is. You've got to talk to Lily about getting along with Kenny. Lily can make her own friends. It's not about making friends. We're all in this together. We gotta start acting like it. Uh, stuff all that. We'd be fine without you. I really don't like you. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. You mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. I won't give you my axe. Uh, here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? Come on, Larry, give it a rest, man. Things are different. Being a racist is outdated. Oh, and that's what you think this is? Is that what you told him? Yeah, it is. Uh... Yeah. Yeah, that's right. And what are you going to do about it? Look, I don't care what it is, but you two have got to start trying to get along. I want to kill you. The him. only thing I have to do is protect my dog. And yourself. And right now, from that me. means getting this damn wall fixed. So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. You take a long walk off a short fucking period, you prick. And don't mess up my axe. I need that. Who else is getting food over here? Uh, you know, I wanted to... Yeah.
What are you doing to my axe, man? Really, what are you doing with my axe? You have any idea what the hell you're doing at all? Uh, I'm gonna get my last piece of food. Oh, I'll give it to the boss. Where'd she go? Maybe I can't give it to her because she's already took hers. She did. I'll give it to Kenny. Want something to eat? Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Yeah, I fucking ate. Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. Not such an easy job, is it? No. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. <clears throat> hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. Yeah, of course. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. You're out! What happened to my food? There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. Something needs to be done about that old guy. And I knew just the Ken, thing. You we gotta smash his head with the salt lamp. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh, what do you he want? He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... I'm sick of this shit, too. You don't think I am? Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's for the best. We're already struggling to feed our own kids. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem. Well, at least the last thing he knew was Shenry 36 cut his leg off. Whoa! 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 You need to back up, buddy! Fuck out of here! Give me the axe! Are you kidding me? Get the fuck off me! Get out of here! Hit him with the goddamn axe! Ah. God damn it! Motherfucker! Get the fuck! <laughs> Woo. You okay? Oh, yeah. Thanks. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! You said he wasn't bitten! What? We asked you point blank, was he bitten, and you said no! Good point. He wasn't! Well, your not bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking what? about? It's not the bite that does it. What is it? You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. You're full of shit. You're lying. It's true. I swear it. Maybe he's right. I didn't see any bites. It would explain why there's so many of them. Jesus Christ. If you just die, and that's all it takes. And shit. One fatal car wreck in a family of five turns into a family of walkers. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym, and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she... Jenny came. Pitcher? She took some I made out with her behind the lot of fucking them. concession stand. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning, and... God. Back off! 
Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. Are you armed? Yeah, F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. But uh, I think you got the upper hand here. Yeah, you're right. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. That's a nice idea. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few <clears throat> miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Food? Oh boy, I don't like this. Why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. Good to know, Carly. So, uh, what do y'all think? You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. 